Georgia's peach crop has suffered significant losses because of a warm winter followed by heavy frost. However, for lovers of peach cobbler, peaches and cream, and peach sweet tea, the news is not all that bad. Elizabeth Shores tells us more. Matthew Presler says the Georgia peach crop disaster hasn't soured North Dakotans on the tasty summer fruit, but it has pinched some customers' pocketbooks. It's put a lot of upward price pressure on the markets. For some customers like Linda Hill, there's nothing that compares to a fresh Georgia peach. A Georgia peach is not mealy, it's juicy, it's sweet. I don't know what else to tell you. They're delicious. Prices are averaging around 30% higher than they were last year. Even our sale price right now at $2.98 a pound, um, you know, last year around this time, you, you're looking at $1.98 a pound. Puzzler says that the further we get into summer, peach prices may become sweeter. South Carolina's crop is going to start to come into the picture. Um, Illinois crop is going to come, and then finally the coup de gras uh, okay. Colorado crop will come into the picture. So as these other states uh, start coming to market, we might see prices drop. Many people love to eat peaches during the summer, but North Dakotans love to can them. And we still have a lot of people who can, so that's that's devastating, you know, to, to us. The news isn't all rotten, though. Presler says California has developed a way to imitate Georgia's unique growing conditions. After they pick them, they warehouse them warm for one to two days, and they control that humidity in the building um, up to about 98 to 100 percent. For customers craving a peachy treat, CashWise hasn't had a problem keeping the summer staples stocked. In Bismarck, I'm Elizabeth Shores, reporting for your news leader. Peaches are a key ingredient in Kuchen, a popular German pastry.